and girls and welcome back to slam this month we're still hearing some of jesus's best known parables crowds would come from far and wide to hear jesus preach and listen to what he was trying to tell them the world puts a dollar sign on everything that has worth items are worth more or less expensive depending on what people are willing to pay for them and sometimes earthly treasures seem more valuable or seem like things that we should purchase. But what about heavenly treasures? What do you think it might mean to seek God's kingdom over other kinds of treasure? In the parable Jesus told today, he talked about how heaven is a treasure that we should value. Jesus said the kingdom of heaven is like a great treasure or a beautiful pearl that someone would give up everything to get. When something is extra special, we're often willing to sacrifice something else to obtain it. Sometimes we might give up playing with our toys in order to go to soccer practice, or we might have to skip watching TV or a movie to study for a test. In the end, it's worth it though, because we get something of greater value. We're able to see our friends at our soccer practice and have fun, and we earn a great grade in school. Well, life with Jesus is the same way. In the parable, people are willing to give up their own treasures to obtain a much more significant treasure. And we recognize that there's no earthly dollar amount, right? Or object value that even begins to match what Jesus does for us or what he means for us. He paid the ultimate price for us to free us and to forgive us. 
because of that, we know that we will go and be able to join him in heaven one day. We have to be willing to accept and receive Jesus into our hearts. Following God might mean sometimes that we don't do everything our friends do. And it might mean that we need to say some things differently or act differently to show that we're followers of Jesus and we're disciples. It's not always easy, but it's so worth it. We know that our heavenly home awaits us and that it's more precious and valuable than anything we could hope for here on earth. When we seek the kingdom of God, we recognize that we have hope in his promises. He will give us a wonderful new life someday. So no matter what kind of treasures we find on earth, our current lives are just the start of an amazing one with God. And that's something that's truly treasure now and always. To close out today, I wanted to say a little prayer with all of you. So if you'll join me now. Dear Jesus, thank you so much for all of the gifts that we have in our life. Please help us to recognize their value. Please help us to recognize your value in our life every day. Help us to appreciate you and share your love with everyone we meet. We thank you, Jesus, and we love you. Amen. Well, boys and girls, thank you for joining me for another week of SLAM. I look forward to talking with you again next week. Have a good day.